you may see over the next few months that the housing market is increasing drastically as compared to year over year from last year around this time. Last year, data covering March, April, May, and June, we saw significant decrease in the housing market because of that dirty little C word. I have a feeling the news and headlines in the upcoming months are going to boast of massive increases as compared to last year. The media tends to do that a lot, but that isn't really the case. As we have certainly had a great year as far as home appreciation in the housing market due to one of the lowest inventory levels I've seen over the past 20 years in conjunction with one of the lowest interest rate levels. But if you compare last year's numbers to this year's, it will seem strikingly different. It's not so much the market as it is what was happening last year at this time compared to what is happening now. Basically, essentially, the increase is due to two things that were happening last year around this time, drastically lowering the number of houses on the market. The virus, along with a continued unseen number of purchases. We've been selling real estate in Northern and Central California for over 20 years. If I didn't know any better, I'd be fooled also. Please be cautious making any decision without speaking with someone who's got the experience and the knowledge to help you with an informed decision. Bottom line, there's, there's probably going to be some crazy headlines about the sensational real estate market as compared to last year, but don't be fooled. The market is finally getting back to normal. Feel free to reach out to us. And if you'd like a hassle-free virtual assessment of your property, we'd be glad to hop on a Zoom call with you as well. We are Jim and Lisa Kwashnick with Homes by Jim and Lisa and EXP Realty, and we'd love to help. And as always, Lodi, California, remember, even if you are selling a home on your own, you are never alone with Jim and me.